Welcome back, rock stars. I am Casey, the rock star flipper. Thank you for joining me here on December 20th, 2017. Just five days till Christmas, and actually, today is almost over, so we're pretty much at four days till Christmas. Um, I got one last thing I'm gonna pick up. All our Christmas shopping has been pretty much done, so we're in good shape. Do you have your Christmas shopping done? Everyone good to go? Everyone got what they need? Everyone got everyone covered? Don't forget anyone. Um, tell me what you look forward most to Christmas. I look forward to relaxing for a few days, of course. I'll take a day or two off work. Probably still post some videos for you guys to see. I'll work on them before Christmas, schedule them, and get them out to post on that day. So when you're done visiting, done gifts, done dinner, done family, sitting around your computer, maybe a new MacBook, who knows, You'll be able to watch some good content from me. Um, so tonight, I wanna to talk about items that you can post on eBay that will instantly sell within 24 hours of you posting them, as long as you post them reasonably priced. If you don't go crazy, you post them correctly, these are items I can guarantee you with a 99.999, if not 100% certainty, when you list them, they will instantly sell within 24 hours, if not faster on eBay. Let's just take a look at them. They're the items you would suspect to see. Some of them, some of them you probably won't think to be on this list, but I guarantee you not just from my experience, but from a poll of all of my Facebook group users, my YouTube subscribers and others, these are items that as quickly as they can list them, they fly off the shelves. And anytime I list any of these items, I pretty much sell them in the first day also. Whether it's buy it now, best offer, whatever it is, they're gone. Like you should never auction these items unless you really, really think you're gonna push the price up. Let's take a look at them on my screen right now. All right, we are on my eBay channel and I'm gonna do a mix of some clothing, some toys, some electronics, some home goods. I'm gonna give you guys a mix of stuff that is just like instant sellers. And I'm gonna start off with my favorite and probably everyone else's least favorite. This is Donald Trump ties. Now we all know that, tr that neckties are slow moving, really long tail items, but Donald Trump ties fly off the shelf. As soon as you put up a Donald Trump tie, it's gonna sell or you're gonna start getting best offers. I've never kept one more than a day or two. I have a few in my store I just listed that I think have been up two days. I priced them really high on purpose, um, but if I wanna sell them, I can move these things within a couple of hours. Donald Trump ties just roll out the door. Look at these things. There's one that sold for 100, you got one selling for 20, some selling for 40. Anywhere from 15 to 50 is probably a good range for these things. Right in the middle, you know, 20, 30 dollars. Pretty good um, indication. Look at this one. Trump Enterprises. This one sold for uh, 47 plus three shipping. Really, really good. All right, number two is Robert Graham dress shirts. If you're not familiar with this brand, I love it. Everyone that knows me knows I love it. And uh, his shirts are two, three hundred bucks brand new. You can almost always guarantee you're gonna get 20 out of them unless you do something wrong. Um, if you get less than 20, you're crazy. You should be getting 30, 40 for these normally, and you should be able to get for the better ones, you know, 50, 60, some of these things on up over 100 on the used market. But good average price for these is going to be about, you know, 35, 45, 30, 40. Um, really shouldn't be too much more than that unless it's a really, really good shirt. So Robert Graham sells immediately. Lily Pulitzer for the women, her dresses fly. As soon as I get one, they're gone. If you price those things at 30 bucks, 40 bucks or less, you're gonna get it all day. Look at these, 45, uh, that's 34 with the shipping. That's 28, uh, 45, 53. Lily Pulitzer dresses just, her brands are good, her clothing is popular on eBay, and her dresses really, really fly off the shelf. Let's continue on. Burberry button-down shirts, men's or women's. These check patterns, anything with the Nova check on it, that's what they call it, the black, the brown. The solids, not so well, but anything Burberry button-down Nova check sells really, really fast. I've picked up about a half a dozen of these different styles and colors, uh, including the Burberry Brit, inside of thrift stores, and I always got 40 to 50 and 60 on some of them. My most expensive one, I got 80. So definitely look for those. Miss Me Jeans, especially the em embellished Angel Wings, embellished La Fleurier, which is this one. It's like the New Orleans Saints style. Anything with big embellishments on Miss Me Jeans is a quick $30 sale. You should not hold Miss Me Jeans more than a day or two. If you're not getting offers or inquiries about them and they've been up more than you know maybe three days and you've done something wrong, you've photographed them wrong, you've priced them wrong, Miss Me Jeans should go out the door quickly. If you're having issues with that, comment down below and I'll take a look at your listings. If you have them active right now, I will take a look. So Miss Me Jeans, definitely on the list. Let's move over to some electronics, which is iPod Touch 
fifth generation. That's the one with the camera. Um, it also is a longer one. It looks like a regular iPhone almost, but it's an iPod. These will not stay. People love these. These are the latest, greatest iPod, even though they're about three years old, four years old. They still used for the right gigabytes will fetch anywhere from about 70 or 80 on up to about 110 to 120, sometimes a little more. Um, these things will just shoot out the door. You should be able to source them on Craigslist, Facebook, or offer up. Buy them for 50, sell them for 90, make a couple dollars. Also, the newest iPod Nano, which has been out for several years, three, four years, maybe five years, is the 7th gen. These are similar, similarly priced. Wow, say that a while. They will sell anywhere from you know, 60 bucks on up to 100, 110, all different colors. These are full touchscreen Nanos. People love them to run with. Next is our classic iPod generation six or seven, 120 gig, 160 gigs. These are the old school click wheel, click wheel iPods, but they have huge gigabyte hard drives like 120s and 160s, which the Nanos just don't support with their 1632 64s. That's why everyone loves them. They're bigger, they're not touchscreen, but people just want the bigger hard drive. So make sure if you can find these at pawn shops for 30 bucks, you grab them all day long and they will sell immediately. I don't keep these on the shelf more than a few hours. All right, Pokemon Game Boy games. If they're real, make sure you know they're real. I'm talking about any of the Game Boy Advance games, the regular Game Boy, and Game Boy Color games. Especially these blues, these reds, the gold edition, the silver editions can be worth $20 and $30. These Game Boy Advanced versions like Ruby, Sapphire, Leaf can be worth $15 or $20 each. Um, these things will sell as soon as you list them. If they're real and you post it, they will sell immediately. If you take a look, here's a good way to tell if something's really selling quickly. Do you see the 12,463 um, listings there? There were like 10,000 active and 12,000 sold. That's a pretty telling number. That means in the last, however, was this 90 days I have it set to or 60 days, 22,000 have been listed and over half of them have already sold. So something to keep an eye on right there, that number versus how many are active. If there's like 20,000 active and 200 have sold, it's not a popular item, it's not selling. But if you've got you know a thousand active and two or three thousand have already sold, they're basically selling faster than people can list them. So, good way to uh, to keep an eye on what you're selling. Of course, the Super NES and NES classics, uh, tough to get. Don't buy them at retail. There's really no money to be made. You're going to be lucky after fees and shipping to make five or ten bucks, maybe twenty, but I don't think it's doable. Um, but these things, no sooner that they're listed, they sell, and that's why I put them on the list because. If you happen to get one, if you happen to be able to make some money on it, as fast as you can list it, it'll sell. Don't give best offer. Don't give you know all these discounts. Don't give this, don't give that. Just post it, pick a price that you wanna sell it at, include the shipping or put free shipping and add it into the price and it will sell right away. iPhone 7s and 7 Pluses. 41,900 units have moved in the last 60 or 90 days, whatever I'm set to. And uh, I believe there's only like 35,000 active. Whenever a new phone comes out, the oldest model will sell like hotcakes, crazy. So the iPhone 8 came out, that means this iPhone 7, 7 Plus is selling. We had the iPhone X come out at the same time, no one's gonna be getting rid of 8s, so they're still getting rid of 7s and 7 Pluses. Kind of still the same for 6, 6S, 6S Plus and all those, but these 7s and 7 Pluses are selling and they're selling for big money, 400, 450, 500, I mean, you name it, they're selling for it. Same when Apple comes out with a new MacBook, which they did. Um, they've had one out for a little while. They also came out with new iMacs. These MacBook Pros and MacBook Airs will fly out the door. Now they lose value, but you can still get a fair amount of money compared to what you paid if you brought it, bought it new. I bought mine used and I could probably still recoup most of the money and I've had it for several years. So really, really popular MacBook Pros when they come out with a new version of it, a lot of people get it and you'll find a lot of them up for sale. Okay, we're gonna move over to one of my favorites. I'm a watch guy and Movado watches. I've bought several from pawn shops. They'll put them in the case for $100. I'll talk them down to 60 or 70 and I'll relist them on eBay for like 139, 149. Sold, sold, sold. Uh, the nicer, the fancier, the more embellished. You know, this rose gold, uh, Movado bold Swiss gold road, rose gold ion plated stainless steel watch. Um, sold for 160 bucks, which is cheap because I bought this for Kate brand new and it was like $700. Uh, Movado, very popular brand, very, very easy to sell if you happen upon these. Pawn shops, great place to get them, but check the battery working, check the condition, check for chips, check for the, 
the band. Check for everything, and if you can get it cheap, get it cheap, compare it to the others, and sell it. I actually own this Movado Bold with the steel um, band, and uh, I could probably sell it for about two to two fifty right now. Something I would have probably picked up in a pawn shop for a hundred. Mine came from a jewelry store, and I paid full price, but great place to get watches right here on eBay. Next is Keurig Coffee Makers. They maintain their popularity, but they don't sell for a ton. If you can get a good used one, it is heavy. You might be able to flip it for some money, but Keurig sell as soon as they hit the eBay auction block. To go along with that is the KitchenAid mixers, the tabletop ones, very expensive. eBay ran a deal on this for Black, Black Friday, but they do maintain value and they do sell crazy high. People love these mixers. It doesn't have to be KitchenAid, it can be other brands. Also, you can part these out if someone has broken ones. You could sell this stuff so, so fast. And probably the hottest kitchen item of the year is the Instant Pot. Um, for a reseller to get it and wholesale, it might be difficult, but if you can, this thing is incredible. All three different sizes, I think. And I mean, these things are selling out left and right. They're hard to keep on the shelf. There's plenty on eBay right now, actually. They did run low for a while. But uh, to give you an example, there's 2,600 sold. I think there was only like 2,500 active. So again, selling as fast as people can list them. Uh, Amazon Echo, um, not terribly as popular as some of the other items. There's 8,000 sold and there was like 10,000 listed. So almost an even split but it's a very popular item. A lot of people asking for it this year. And uh, basically it's like a digital media uh, device. You can um, use your voice activation to have it do stuff for you. And uh, it's got Alexa voice on it. It's very cool. You can tell it to like change the channel or play music or search for something. And uh, they do sell out very fast. The hottest toy of the year, of course, it's Fingerlings and um, 92,000 units have been moved on eBay in X amount of time. I believe this is 90 days. It might be 60, but 90. Um, a lot of people going retail arbitrage on these to try to flip them. And if you do, pretty good chance, even if you don't make a big profit, you'll get your money out of them very, very quickly. Um, 92,000 sold. I mean, that's crazy. You're talking about, what, 3,000 a day selling over a month. And uh, what, if it's three months, so about 1,000 a day over 90 days, more than 1,000 per day. That's crazy numbers. Last is last year's number one hot toy. It was Hatchimals, but a lot of the Hatchimal egg carton, animal break accessories are all still selling really well. You can't go into a store and buy a Hatchimal like you did last year and flip it for retail, but you could sell a lot of the other stuff and maybe perhaps um, use stuff. I'm not sure how that works, but uh, I know the Hatchimals has sold, let's look at the number, 15,600 units in 90 days so very strong sales for Hatchimal any things if you can get any pretty cool and uh, that's gonna be the 20 items that if you list on eBay they are going to sell instantly within 24 hours I call that instant and uh, if you have any issues with that comment down below tell me some other items to add to the list maybe we can do a part two of this because there are a ton of other items that will sell you know iPads to tablets to Samsung phones you name it, there's a lot of other stuff that will sell just as quickly as you can list it. I'd love to hear what you think. I'd love to hear your item suggestions. And I'd love to hear if there's something that you constantly list that sells instantly down in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. Check out the description box, links to my eBay store, links to all the items I use to make these videos from my lighting kit to the computer, the microphone, all that stuff, everything you need for eBay and Amazon. Shipping supplies, scales, all linked down below. If you need to buy it, please use those links or please at least use those links to travel to Amazon and eBay and then do your buying. Anybody you buy from helps me and I really, really appreciate it. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful night.